Hello and welcome to this exquisitely exquisite unboxing event. We have right here the most exquisite collection of exquisiteness because we are tea drinkers and we've decided to be the ultimate tea drinking kind of people. Oh, Farquhar. Farquhar. Get me out of this misery and unbox the unboxes. Okay, you can open up this guy. I'll show the collection here. So we have, this is the Royal Albert collection of teacups. Oh my. And it is, it's, I'll just show you the box. It's so beautiful. The Royal Albert from England, 1904. Ooh. Now, this is not the Albert from EastEnders, but this is the Royal Albert of Royal Albertness. Now, you may be thinking, what on earth are these guys on? But this has been around for decades. 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 And apparently, it's the number one selling in the world. In the world. Most fancied teapot collection there is. And it is called Old Country Roses. Old Country Roses. Now, let me help you out there. I've got plates. You've got to be super careful. You've got cups. Let me just show oh, the you. The teapot. Let me just show you all what is inside. So when you unwrap all of these beautifully wrapped up pieces, it's gorgeous, isn't it? Look at that, roses, and it's got gold plated, and it's actually gold plated by, I think, um, how many carats of gold? 22. 22 carats of gold, like you could literally scrape this off and sell it, and you'd be making money. Making money! That's beautiful. The color is exquisite. It's not financial advice, by the way. Check it out for yourself. On the back it says, Old Country Roses, Royal Albert, Bone China, 19... 62 Royal Albert Limited. That is beautiful. So, the next time you're planning a tea party, this is what you need to get. Now, it does come with a bunch of sauces, tea and sauces. I think it's six altogether, but we're going to unbox them and find out. We've got three, four, five, six. Yep, six. So, you need six friends to hang out with. And uh, that's okay because even if you don't have six friends, you can pretend you've got six friends and you can set it up anyway. Oh, this is the one I want to see. Okay, I'm going to let you run and wrap this up. This is the teapot. Ooh. I got the hair. This is so fancy. This is a good size. You know what I'm going to do? I think tomorrow morning, I'm literally going to have my tea. No, I want teapot. some tea, yeah. This is gorgeous. So, it's oh, it so regal. Decky dance. I dance. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, I love this. It's so big, isn't oh, it? Oh, my goodness. Yes, thank you. That's how much tea I need to drink a day. <laughs> it's got a bit of BDSM going on there. A bit of lingerie. A bit of lingerie for the teapot. <laughs> no, do you know the fishnet legs? Yeah. Fishnet leggings. That is beautiful. That is so fancy. Oh, I like that. That is like tea for one, in my opinion. <laughs> Look at that nice teacup. Teacup's oh, a bit small. God. Because usually I have my tea in a, a tea container. <laughs> so I'm going to have to get used to that. I like that. That is so fancy. I love the gold platedness. I mean, obviously, you can only really hold this in one way, which is like this. Ta -ra, ta -ra. Milk jug. Ta oh, a milk jug is what we're going to have a tea party at. I just can't wait. We're going to have a tea party. This is so much fun. Oh, I love it. The design is just exquisite. Look at that. That is gorgeous. It's so carefully wrapped. There's no damage on these whatsoever. Oh my goodness, I feel like just hosting a tea party, just for jokes, because why not? Oh my goodness me. Very consistent, the finish. Yeah, there were some people saying that there were some issues because they've changed the, the, um, the production country. But Apparently it's, it's, it's nice. now made in Bangladesh. Oh, okay. Although it doesn't say anything. It doesn't not, say where it's made. It just, it just says bone China. Bone China. China. Oh, I like this. This is so cute, isn't it, Ash? It still looks, it looks really fancy. Who is it? I want to have a tea party. I'm not even joking. Me too, shall we? Yeah. Just you and I. Stay tuned on the next episode. We'll be featuring this whole collection, this big box inside the Amazon box as well. The teapot party collection. Oh my. Is there anything more in that box? That's it. Well, I have to say that is really quite exquisite. That is actually like better than what I'd expected it to be. Actually, it's really pretty. I love it. It's so nice. So it comes with six teapots. It is exquisite. This is the 15 piece tea set of the Old Country Roses by Royal Albert. And taking the center stage is the beautiful, magnificent tea, teapot for one, in my opinion, because that's how much tea I would drink on a daily basis. It also comes with a milk jug, a sugar pot for your sugar needs, and six teacups and tea sauces, all covered with 22 karat gold, fine bone china, and look absolutely exquisite. My goodness, why would you not want to go out in the garden and have a piece of cake and a scone with this beautiful teapot party? Oh my goodness, I love it. You know, I think I'm gonna have to make some scones now. What'd you say? So I've got some exciting news for you. What? We are only getting started. We've got the big box coming up. 
Oh my but God. let's check out the little box. Now you're gonna, you're actually gonna love what's inside this little box. It actually looks really fancy. Oh my goodness. Oh, I just love the pink boxes. They are so special. Hey, it looks like candy. Oh, it's so cool. All right, ladies, do the offer. All right. Hope it's in one piece. England 1904. It does look really fancy. It does look so exquisite. It makes you want to talk like a bit of a British accent. I believe. British accent. I love the king and queen. They are my favorite people. Oh, it's so cute. There's some stuff inside here. Oh, so there's a little tutorial on how to set it up. Oh, Look at that. So it says over here, they pretty much just connect to oh, each wow. other. Look. They like them. It's a little bit dirty. I wonder if someone's used it before. But maybe you just have to wash it. Let's see. Did that come off? Yeah, it looks like it's just dirt. A bit of glue. Maybe glue, yeah. I don't, it doesn't look used. No, it doesn't. It's maybe that's the Bangladeshi production. Maybe they had to test it before they packaged it away. <laughs> and they left a bit of... Perhaps. A bit of cakes on Was it there. one of them that's slightly dirty or...? One, for now. One. Oh, it's beautiful. So the idea of this cake here is that it's got three pieces and the, the plates get bigger as they go down. And... You know, I've been thinking about having high tea with Ash for some time now. Is that what it's called? It's called high tea. And, um, well, we figured why not bring high tea to the home? So you get some washers here, plastic washers, and some bolts, and a screw right there. So you use a flat head on the bottom, then you use a large washer, then you screw in one of the... Well, it passed the durability test, that's good. So I got the stem over on top. And below, got the screw, so I'm going to screw it nice and tight. It's gorgeous. It's nice and solid. And the washer is keeping it from damaging the plate. You now want to use a, a large washer between the two now. So it's two large washers, and then the middle plate, and then a large washer on the top. Each of your plates should be protected with a large washer so that it doesn't get scratched. And, and I guess then... it's a bonus challenge of making the patterns match up. So before you fully True. tighten it up, there it is. There you go, look then... at that. See, you can have oodles of fun with this. Oy, it's all right, give it a spin. Oh, oh give my it a spin. God. Look at that. We're gonna have some sandwiches on the bottom. We're gonna have some scones on the top and we're gonna have some cakes on the top as well. Look at that, oh, it's stunning. I cannot wait to have a tea party. But wait, there's one thing missing. Dun, dun, dun. <gasps> What's that? This comes in from Peter's of Kensington. And this is the piece de resistance, the final piece of the collection. Personally, I think my favorite so far is the teapot collection. I love that. The is, that is the must have. Yes. We actually got that on Black Friday sale. So we have 70% yes. off. Yes. So if you are thinking about this, wait until the sales come along because you can score yourself a fantastic deal because literally the next day, the prices just went zoom really high up. So we got this at a bargain, I think. Okay, so right now we've got the Royal Albert Old Country Roses dinner set, 16 piece. Oh my God, not only are we having a tea party. Tea biscuits also, dinner. You know, have a dinner party. We're gonna have to get a buffet after this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And some friends. Wow, what do we have here? We've got soup bowls. Oh my goodness, these are beautiful. Where am I gonna keep all of these? <laughs> That's what I wanna know. You're gonna have to get a buffet. Gosh, they look gorgeous. I'm gonna keep these there. Wow, mixing the collections they up. I like stunning. it. I really like these, Ash. I'm actually very pleased. So it comes with like four soup bowls. Is that right? Four soup bowls. That's very, very generous. Four soup bowls, like that. Got little plates over here. Oh, dinner. is that dinner plate? No, these are the small plates. <gasps> small plates. They're like more for cookies and biscuits. Oh, yes. And finger food. It's high tea. Hi, T. We're going to have to have like, a dinner party and just invite you guys because it's so much fun. Going to roll Albert dinner party on this channel oh, very soon. Oh my gosh, look at the dinner plates. Whoa, they're big. They're huge. Wow. Now, these I don't think are microwave. Oh, they are made in Bangladesh. It says here made in Bangladesh. Oh, wow. On this one, it does say it's made in Bangladesh. Um, to be honest with you, I don't know what it looks like if it's not made in Bangladesh. So I'm a bit naive to that. No, the sticker says it's made in Bangladesh, but the actual yeah. plate itself, once you remove the sticker, oh, say you won't know where it's from. It doesn't say at all, which is good, I guess, because you kind of want to think that it's made in the UK, don't you? Because it's... I have noticed there's a little scrape on one of these plates. A little tiny scrape. That's a little scrape. Wow, Ash, I think it's looking amazing. Look at this lovely set that we've got. There's more. It's really cool. This is my favourite part. What's this one? Coffee cups. Oh, my goodness. 
Oh, these are awesome. These are like probably what I'm going to use to drink the tea out of. <laughs> They're a bit bigger. Oh, oh, these are really cute. I like these. Yeah. I like these ones. I don't like these stickers. Yeah, they're going to be so annoying to peel off. I think they're going to be... Peel like them off sticky. straight away. They're going to be sticky, aren't they? The sooner you peel them off, the better. I think they're going to leave a sticky, sticky. Yeah. Oh. oh kind of. It's annoying. That's the annoying thing. I can see why people don't like the Made in Bangladesh editions. Why do you have to stick a sticker on it? Yeah, like, get your Made in Bangladesh. Just keep it. Don't, her, don't keep need to advertise her. it. I know, just, like, keep it. And it comes in a collection. You don't need stickers on the on collection. every single piece. It's not like I'm rid of buying it individually. You can see, left a lot of... And I don't want to be too aggressive here because I don't want to get rid of the beautiful print. So we'll have to just be a bit careful removing this glue. So I guess when you're having your, your friends over for dinner, you might just do something like this. You have your... Soup. Then you have your starter. And then you have your main course. And then you just have your tea for your desserts. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. <laughs> It's so cute. Thank you so much. Oh, Ash, you know what? I'm really quite pleased with this set. When we bought it, we were a bit like hesitant. We we're like, oh, do we, do we like this? This is nice. But seeing in real, oh, you did make a big mess of this one, didn't you? <laughs> Seeing it in real life really has just helped me to affirm that I do like this. I'm looking forward to our next tea party. Pish posh. Cheers. Cheerio. Let us know what amazing tea set collection you guys have yes. over in your homes. Hope you guys found this amazing, terrific video useful and enjoyed the show. Yes, yes. Hey, Farquhar, do serve me some tea. Farquhar. Farquhar.